Good morning, my dear friend. Hope you're well today. We're looking at Isaiah 65 this Monday morning, and we're in the middle part of the chapter, and uh, there's a change that's happened in the chapter. The Lord is primarily pronouncing judgment early on, but promising salvation, but he's talking about creating new things. In verse 16 it says, So that he who blesses himself in the land shall bless himself by the God of truth, and he who takes an oath in the land shall swear by the God of truth, because the former troubles are forgotten and are hidden from my eyes. For behold, I create new heavens and a new earth, and the former things shall not be remembered or come into mind. Verse 18. Be glad and rejoice forever in that which I create. And the Lord does want us to learn to rejoice, to be glad, to be thankful in the circumstances that he's put us in. He's put such wonderful things all around us. He wants us to express joy to him. So let's go to the Lord in prayer today. Just say, Lord, we want to pronounce joy, profess joy today. Joy in what you've done and what you're doing and what you're yet to do. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we come to you today. Lord, we're thankful for the day you brought us to. And Lord, we want to have a rejoicing attitude. Lord, for all that you're doing in us, for the mighty work of your hand, we thank you and praise you in Jesus' name. Amen.